Hey everyone, this is the hike to Verdugo Peak on the Vital Link Trail. And there is the Vital Link Trail sign to prove, prove it. Um, it's a fun hike. It's the uh, tallest peak here in the Verdugo Mountains, which are right kind of in the middle of LA. They're undeveloped, which is nice. It's a kind of by Burbank and Glendale. And uh, you get great views. You can see downtown LA, you can see all the valley, Burbank Airport, and then into Angeles National Forest. So it's a fun hike. It's steep. It's tough in the beginning, but the second half is uh, pretty cruisy. And if you want to do it, I have all the guides and parking and all that information on hikingguy.com. But otherwise, let me show you these turn by turn directions to get there. So the hike starts through this grand stone arch here at, at uh, Wildwood Canyon Park in Burbank. There's a few places you can start the hike. Um, I have the directions to this area in the hiking guide on Hiking Guy with the parking info. So you get here, you can start going up. Once you go through the gate, as you see, it starts a series of little switchbacks. It's um, steep, but it will get steeper in a little bit. And pretty soon you leave the trees and any shade that you have on the hike. Now this can get really hot because there is no shade, especially in the summer, and this area can get pretty hot in general, so prepare accordingly. But the nice thing about not having trees is you have the views and you'll be able to start to see the valley down there in Burbank. Then you keep going up and you're gonna to get to this intersection where you make the hard right. To the left is one of the other um, trails that you can take from the park to start it. It's a little bit farther down in the park. But we're gonna make the right and continue to head up here. And you're gonna get more and more views. You're gonna get some views of downtown LA the higher you climb. The nice thing is once you start getting the views, you're gonna get them pretty much the entire way up um, and at the top on the way back down. And then you're also gonna get views up ahead to um, Verdugo Peak, which is the peak in the distance with the one tower on it. Don't get fooled and think it's the one you're heading to. You'll be disappointed. And here you can see the trail winding up along the ridge line. So this trail basically takes the ridge all the way up to the spine of the Verdugo Mountains where you go across. There's the Burbank Airport. There's a lot to see, a lot of great scenery. So when it does get steep, I would just take a breather and turn around and soak it all in. Now this is an important turn here. You're gonna make the left onto the Vital Link Trail. And it's got this kind of vintage trail sign that's a little worn, worn around the edges, but this is the trail. And from here, you're gonna go pretty much straight up until you get to the towers up ahead. And this shot gives you a good idea of how steep it is. Now one of the things to consider is that there's a lot of cutoffs on this trail. And sometimes it's hard to know whether you're leaving the trail or taking a cutoff, but generally the cutoffs will join within a minute or two. So if you take a cutoff and it doesn't join up, then you are in the wrong place. And here's one of the trails off to the right. We're gonna go left. There's also some trails where it splits and it's a longer um, alternate route, but if you just follow this way, you'll be fine. And that was the left there. And then soon after that, there's another left here. There are some trails that go back down into the park, so um, it does help to have a GPS with a GPX file if you have it. More great views. There's not a lot of flat sections from here up to the ridge, but uh, you get a couple to catch your breath. This is one of them. When I say flat, you can see it's not super flat, but a little climbing, and you're gonna head up to those towers right there. And then once you get to those towers, you get to the end of the Vital Link Trail, which is right here. It's marked by a stone marker the way the other one was. There are the towers. There's the marker. There's this pretty awesome seat here where you can soak in the views. There's the Burbank Airport, and another one of those funky trail signs. Now, your intuition is gonna be telling you to go to the right, but that's actually a dead end into the communication towers. There is a cool bench there, and I have a waypoints in the hike GPX for you. Uh, so if you wanna go there and catch your breath, there's a nice place to sit. But otherwise, we're going to kind of counterintuitively head away from Verdugo Peak and a little bit downhill here on this uh, fire road. And after you go downhill, the, the road kind of twists around to the right. And you're going to make this hard right here onto the Verdugo Motorway. And from here on out, we're going to be hiking 
gradually uphill, but generally pretty easy compared to what you just did. And at this intersection to the um, plantation lateral, you're gonna make the right. There's a nice bench down there too if you wanna soak it in. Um, you're gonna be able to start to see Angeles National Forest. That's Mount Lucan's with all the towers and that pointy one to the right, the Strawberry Peak. Uh, a lot of great mountain spotting here. We're gonna go straight past all of these towers, hopefully not get irradiated in the process. And here at the Hot Setter Fire Road, we're gonna bear right and head up towards the peak. That's the antenna there, that's it in the distance. And we're gonna go a little bit more and eventually it's gonna to turn to pavement. We're gonna go up the pavement for the last little stretch. There's a trail down to the left as well. We're not gonna take that. Now when you get to the top, the antennas are all surrounded by this fence, but you just do this little sneaky path here around the edge of the fence and you keep going around and eventually you're gonna come out to a series of benches and that's the peak. So you just soak it all in and uh, you can actually see the Vital Link Trail and the trail you came up down in the distance to the left there. So that's it, Verdugo Peak, give it a try. It's fun, Vital Link Trail is probably the most popular trail up here and you get to bag uh, the highest points in the Verdugo Mountains here. Um, now, this video is meant to be a companion piece to the full article on hikingguy.com. So if you're watching on YouTube, just go to the article. It's in the link right under the video, and you'll get maps and parking info and all that information. If you're watching on YouTube, if you could do me a favor, you can say thank you by clicking the little thumbs up button. That will help other people find this video. Hopefully, uh, be informed to do it safely. And if you have any questions, ask them in the YouTube comments, and I will do my best to get back to you. So Verdugo Peak, give it a whirl. At the end, you're rewarded to beautiful views like this.